I believe in God, I yes. believe in Holy Spirit. Yes. God changed my life. God give me everlasting life. All right, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel where today we are still in Brashov. Now I said in the previous video I was going to Galat and I was thinking of going to a gypsy wedding, but it turns out I didn't have time to get there and get back. I couldn't make it in the end. I will be going to Galat for my friend's gypsy wedding next year. But for now, I'm staying in Brashov, and today we are going to be climbing up the Hollywood Hill Brashov uh, mountain thing. Do you know the name of it? No, no, but. No, it's just the Hollywood sign. If you haven't seen it, it's written in the exact same font as the, uh, the one they have in uh, Los Angeles. I was going to wear this shirt for the wedding, but instead I just thought I'd wear it today, even though we're about to go on a hike. Yeah, you look like the, uh, the most sophisticated hiker I've ever seen. <laughs> Yeah. So as you can see in the distance, they've got working cable cars coming down and up. I think we'll hike up and then get a cable car down. Yep, sounds good to me. Yeah. And that is the brush off sign. Yeah, beautiful spot. Yeah. Gotta say, the ar architecture in the centre is super nice. So another funny thing about Romania is they have a lot of respect for the zebra crossing. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, R Romania, um, we've heard a few stories, you know, on, online that maybe it's the type of place where the law isn't so strict or severe. But me and Zach have been joking at one thing you don't mess with in Romania. It's not stopping at uh, zebra, zebra crossings. crossings. I was driving in the whip and um, I was going... Hello, like, ladies. I was going down the road yeah. normally and um, I saw the zebra crossing quite late and there was a woman waiting to cross with her two sons and... I decided it, I wouldn't have been able to like, you know, it would have been a pretty abrupt stop. And then I did stop sharply in the end. And the, the, the lady and the sons were both looking at me. And then the son gave me the most evil death stare <laughs> in the world. Like, yeah. very protective of his mother. And I thought yeah. that, was, uh, that was actually quite sweet. And so it begins. This is the view of Brashov from the start. Let's see it from the finish. Hello, guys. Hi, Hi there. Hi. Hey. <laughs> Forbidden deviation from Mark Trail. So we've got bears. Um, what are they called? Wild hogs. Hogs, foxes, even lynx. Crazy. Vipers and friendly house cats. So there's about four <laughs> things on that list that could probably kill us. So yeah. You know, so you have to bad. yeah you have to stay on the Mark Trail. And even the Mark Trail is not guaranteed. But I guess animals just. Won't well, well, go near it because yeah, it's a danger to them. Yeah. Pro probably. That's quite intimidating the amount of things they listed off on that. Yeah, people say never to hike alone. Yeah. I've got into my fair share of um, crazy hikes on my own before. Have you? Yeah. So, have you got any stories? Yeah, I've got some good ones. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hit me with one. I hit you with one, so I hit you with the short version. Yeah. I was uh, hiking in Madeira, yeah. which is a volcanic island off the coast of uh, Africa, part of Portugal. Mm hmm. Definitely recommend going by the way for yeah. a future video. Yep. And I was, um, we got the cable car up the first bit of the mountain. I was with my friends. Mm -hmm. I said, all right, lads, who wants to walk to the top? And then they all turned around and were like, I don't really fancy it. At this point, it was about 2 p.m., something like that. And I'd walk further to like the peak. And then once I'd get to that peak, you'd see a higher peak. I kept going higher, higher, higher. And it came to about 7 p.m. And I could see the final peak of the yeah. island. So it started all the way at the bottom. I could see the top peak on the whole island of Madeira. And I thought, you know what? I regret this if I don't go for it. Yeah. So I got up, went to the top. And by the time I got to the top, it was incredible views. But the sun was setting. And it was about, must have been about 7.30 at this point. And I realized I had to walk all the way down the mountain yeah. before the sunset. Because if I get caught up there, yeah. I had a shirt and shorts and no coat, yeah. nothing. I started jogging down the mountain because I realized there's no way if I get caught at this height, I'm actually going to be in danger. So I have to jog down the mountain rapid, rapid, rapid. I got about halfway down. Uh, I'd been walking for six hours at the top of the mountain. It's about 7.30. I realized I have to get down as far as possible. So I start running, just running down this mountain. I'm running for about an hour and a half yeah. and I'm on this ledge which is on the side of like a cliff edge. Yeah. And the visibility is starting to get low. Yeah. And imagine I've been going for, yeah, seven, eight hours at this point. And your mind's starting to play a bit of tricks on you. I've had no food. Yeah. Very exhausted. And I'm trying to jog. 
path's very thin and if I make one wrong slip, you know, I could fall down, mm. so it's pretty dangerous. And I got halfway down the mountain, I arrived at this woods. By this time, it was pitch black. My iPhone had died, I had no torch, no jumper, no food. And I started walking into this pitch black woods. I didn't know this terrain, so I didn't know if there's any predators Ooh, around, yeah. if there's any danger. So I'm just hoping for the best, just yeah. relying on the power of my mind. I was walking for about an hour in this pitch black woods when I realized I'd done a full circle oh, and got no. back to the point where I started at after yeah. walking for an hour. Yeah. And at this point I was exhausted and I couldn't see two feet in front of me. If I've been walking an hour and I've gone in a circle, there's no way I'm making it out of this woods until the sunlight. In order to keep warm, it obviously got very cold at night because it's still pretty high up. I think it was about a thousand meters where I was sleeping. In order to keep warm, I had to wrap my body in fern leaves. I spent about half an hour collecting fern leaves. Really? Bear grills, isn't it? Literally bear grills, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Collecting fern leaves. I found a little cove by a rock. Yeah. Covered myself in the fern leaves. No. And I was just staring, looking up at the stars. It was freezing. Such a <laughs> yeah, YouTube. What is your name? Andre. Hello. 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 <laughs> I've really been embracing discipline lately. Yeah. Trying to make choices that are going to be beneficial to the future and not just, you know, succumbing to instant gratification. Mm -hmm. And, you know, it's tough in that phase because, you know, as humans, we want connection. We want to, like, just enjoy the moment. Yeah. But at the same time, often what's enjoyable in the moment isn't actually what's the best for your future. Mm -hmm. So right now, just making beats every day, hitting the studio every day, yeah. exploring new places, having new experiences. And, um, yeah, being in these vlogs has been a great, yeah. a great lesson in a way to... Hello. Hello. It's beautiful. How are you doing? Oh, that dog is so beautiful. Yeah. I'd love to have a dog like that. I yeah, got a lot of music coming soon. Me and Zach's song's on the way. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be fire. I have to do more as well. Yep. For yep. sure. Yep. Sure. Definitely so, more. where can people reach you? So, they can reach me at NDM Genesis on Instagram. G E N 3 S I S. NDM dot Genesis. Yeah. And yeah, you'll most likely see me in a lot of the comment sections in Zach's channel as well. Mm -hmm. So. Yeah, click on my profile mm. and uh, we've got lots of bangers on the way. I'll pin, him, I'll pin his comments on this. Everyone go subscribe to fire, fire. whatever one of his channels he wants to promote. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyone who comes over from Zach's channel, when I do my first show, you can get a free ticket. Could be bears around anywhere, bro. Lynx. Yeah. Bears Lynx. and lynx and vipers. Yeah, who do you reckon's going to win in a fight though? I saw them. I reckon we got them. We've been training. Yeah. Got them. Maybe if there's 10 bears and a few lynx, then they might have a chance, but if there's only a few, then we're probably, probably a G. If one of those three animals were to attack you, which would you prefer? A bear, lynx, or what? A bear, lynx, or a viper. Viper, probably. But if a viper stings you, that's game over. Is it? Yeah. Hello. Like, a, vi a viper bite is a thing. You can fact check this, guys, in the comments, but... I'm pretty sure a viper is a deadly bite. Uh, if one was attacking me, I feel like, like I'd have more of a chance of running away. Yeah, yeah. Probably, I'd probably go for that one. Everybody in the comments, comment, would you rather get attacked by a bear, lynx, or viper? <laughs> Good thing we're not carrying meat around with us. Yeah. I guess we are carrying meat around with us. Yeah, we are the meat. <laughs> <laughs> when I was in the jungle in Mexico, yeah. a tall guy, I uh, went round with a tour guide in the jungle and he was giving me the advice when you're in the jungle you should always look at your feet because that's how you avoid snakes the biggest threat in the jungle is a snake bite because you're not you won't see it coming if you're not mm -hmm. looking at your feet so that should be your number one priority hello hello hi Right, we're starting to see the view now. Still not at the top, but this is exactly where the cable cart's coming up and down. Yeah, I don't see one coming, but we just, there was just two that passed then. View of the city is looking incredible, man. It's very European, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. The orange roofs. It's a very peaceful society, my guy. Yeah, it would be a peaceful life living here. Mm. Uh, I'm just asking my uh, Romanian viewers, is it is it salute you say to a guy? I'm bon, bueno. You say to a woman, hello. 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 Because I'm not sure. 
I wasn't expecting an actual height, man. I was expecting some steps to the top. Uh, yeah. I'm surviving in this attire. Hello. 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 See how many waves we can go. Give them that million dollar scout spot. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Where else would you like to travel to in the near future? For me, actually, um, somewhere you've been, uh, Colombia. Ah, okay. Yeah, especially with your Spanish being as good as it is and your adventurous attitude, I, I think it's the perfect place for you. Yeah, yeah Medellin and uh, Cartagena. Cartagena, yep. Yeah, they look really good. Did you visit Cartagena? Yeah, just for one night. Oh, you did? Yeah, no, I still didn't for know one that. night. It was, it was yeah. Boss City, yeah, a Boss City. Yeah. Good stuff. My Australian made to go into Cartagena as well. Oh, nice. If you want to link up with Yeah, them. yeah, if it overlaps, I'll have to, yeah. to link up. Yeah, Colombia's a, an interesting one, man. It's it's wild, bro. Mm. Yeah, there's always something going on. You can find yourself in some very interesting situations. I think you'd love it, actually. Yeah. I think Medellin would be your favorite city mm. in the world. And, yeah. uh, the girls are pretty hot there, bro. I don't know why you're mentioning that, bro, because that, that, that shit isn't even important to me. I mean... Yeah. No, I'm joking, I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> didn't catch on. I, I was mean, being sarcastic. But. No, if you kept it at that, that would have looked very respectable. <laughs> Hello. England, Anglia. This song, Amazing Grace. What's the name? What is your name? My name is Adam. Oh, where are you from? From Russia. Yes, Russia. Oh, how is your English? By grace of God, <laughs> in the presence of the Lord. Yes. Yes, I read the Holy Bible. Yes, Jesus Christ. Yes. Orthodox, my Lord. Orthodox my, Christians. I, I uh, um, Protestant. Okay. Protestant. I believe in God. I yes. believe in Holy Spirit. Yes. God changed my life. God gave me everlasting life. Many years in Romania. I soldiers in Romania arms yeah. uh, in 89 with yeah. Yes. The terrorist shot me in my feet. Wow. I, yeah. I go call the commandant of telephone in this moment in the four o'clock morning. The, the people I don't know shot me. Really? I still in hospital three months. Yeah. Operation two fingers. Yep. Go in wheelchair for after the stamper. Yeah. Uh, go with my feet and I pray God, God have mercy of me. I mm. not desire diet yeah. because I young, mm. I live in the sin, yeah. I smoke, yeah. I drink, yes. I not have salvation of the Lord Jesus Christ in my life. In this moment, many years, 
I believe in God, I believe in Holy Spirit, yes. I pray God, God have mercy of me. A God change my life, give healing, give everlasting life, give me the salvation. Uh, God bless you. you, your life, God bless you England, God bless you the young people from England, from London, yes. from every country, return of Jesus Christ. Yes, thank you very much, that was incredible saxophone thank you. Thank player. You. God thank bless you. you my friend. God bless, God bless you. you. I sing uh, the swing, the, the, the song jazz, jazz, jazz music. Yes. Jazz music. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Oh yeah, see Belvedere means beautiful view. So, oh, 15 minutes? Yeah, so it must have been that one up the other way. Oh, it's the, the other way. Yeah, yeah. Oh well. We'll go check it out. This yeah, we've reached the top, but this is where the cable cars are. And uh, we want to see the beautiful view. All right. Yeah, definitely. My guys learned Romanian. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's the same as Italian, so it's a little bit <laughs> in there. But first stop, find a toilet. Yeah. Find that toilet. It feel like its own little town, and then the rest of it's just all out there. We're live at the brash off Hollywood sign. It's an interesting structure. I didn't know what it would quite look like when we were there. What a beautiful view of the city. Watch our bus. <laughs> wow, incredible. Yeah, the Romanian nature is beautiful. And uh, I think this is a good spot to end today's video. It's been an interesting climb up the mountain. Yeah. Wearing my best clothes. And this view is definitely worth it.